Hi Nisa, just doing the research on Fred Kate's photography and uh, this seemed to be the easiest way to show you what we're finding. Besides the onset page stuff, there's some pages, I mean there's a lot of stuff with the, the titles and stuff that are kind of messed up there. Uh, some titles are too long and whatnot, but this is the main thing that we're seeing that is the issue um, besides the stuff on the on page. If you t This tool just kind of gives us an idea of the competitiveness of other clients that are, or other people that are on page one. Um, if you take a look at uh, these here, number one to ten, here's that one that we we're talking about, the Chandra photo. The red means that that's very competitive. Orange means just a little bit less competitive. Green means that there's a big gaping hole where people can slide in fairly easy to the rankings. Uh, this is for Edmonton for Photographer. You can see that these items, there's a lot of competitiveness on the first page. Um, referring domains, uh, referring domain pages, Meaning these are this is mostly links in this area here that's showing me that these a lot of these ones here are doing a lot of stuff for linking, and um, that is the main competitiveness right there. Night and day photo uh, over here is domain age. If you look at all the ones that are here on the first page, the, the youngest one is five years old. That's number one, Nicole Ashley. But look at her backlinks that are coming at her site. Uh, for Fred Kate's photography, I've plunked him in there because he's not in the first page, obviously. Look at his domain age. His domain age is actually the oldest one, which is a good thing. But trust flow is the f lowest, and that's because the backlinks that are going to his site aren't really boosting his site up much for trust. So if you if you look at it as an overall thing here, the number one thing that we see is that the links to going to his site are just not good enough to get him the trust that he needs to be showing on the first page. Uh, I'll show you an example of what you'd normally see, like if, if there's a big gaping hole. He's on his titles, he, there's a lot there that say fine art, for, fine art photography and all that. So we punch this one in, and there he is, number one, and number two, and number three. But that's the one main thing that he's targeting. And you can see all the green here. There's some orange here, but that's not much. There's some green here again. It's it's a term that people aren't really trying to go after much, it looks like to us. So therefore, they're f landing in there because nobody else is really trying much for it. So they end up there on first to third. Uh, it, the big, again, the age of the site is great. Down here, you've got Facebook, which doesn't really count for that because Facebook kind of lands in there because nobody else is really trying much. Um, it, so for us, it looks like there is uh, a lot of linking issues that he just doesn't have enough flow going to his site that says that his site is an authority in the, the area. Uh, I've explained a little bit more in the email and I'll just uh, cut from here and just want to show you that because it's a little bit e easier than trying to take pictures and explain it by an email. Thanks.